we're back again. Two breaks in a span of one break, would you believe it? <laughs> He's just standing there. Alright, so we entered the pirate cave. Oh, he found a water crystal. That's gonna teach me magic. If you remember, within the termites cave, there is actually a hole that leads you to a, a similar looking place with a water crystal, but with no way out. So I don't know if we're gonna, you know, learn the same spell. My guess is we're not, and we need to find a way out. Or we need uh, to find a way to teleport out of the hole in the termites cave. A two out of three. We have two out of three dragon stones. Nice. One more dragon stone and we'll be able to restore the water to the elf's cave. And I also have a shrine key. I don't know if I need it for the elf's cave, but... We're doing good. I mean, we could just purchase a copy for 13,000 gold, but sounds dumb. I'm not gonna do that. Oh! Yo, I found a bastard sword! You know how much money I spent to get the bastard sword? About 2,300 gold. Which was most of my money. Now I have two of those. What the heck? I, I could probably sell it for like 20% of the price. I'm glad I went back there. If I can sell it for a lot of money, I can buy better equipment. Most notably, I'm not really looking for damage. But actually more armor. Because we have a bigger health pool, but it is draining very quickly. Anyway. So that concludes the outside part of the island. Then conc that concludes the outside part of the island. So now... We're gonna go and find the castle. I don't remember exactly where it was. Actually, I think I just remembered where it is. So I'll check it out. So like I suggested before, we should try and get past the castle. And maybe, if we get past the castle, we'll get to the eastern side of the island. Sell the Bastard Sword and buy the Hellbird for range. I'm gonna sell the Bastard soul, uh, Sword for the Bastard who sold it to me. If he's a Bastard, he's, he's gonna sell it for less. I'm gonna be big mad. Alright. Let's refill our HP here. And then refill our remaining flasks. Which is about two. There you go. <laughs> Deflate squid loons. Get deflated. Where does this lead? I know where this leads, but where does the door lead? Now that I have a purchased a key, I should be able to open many of the chests that we came across that were closed. Oh, I see. I know where this is, and I know this is also a dead end, but probably there is a locked chest around here because I did not have a key, right? Hmm. This looks like a mage key would open this, because this looks different. The King of Winds, King Harvin III, had started to construct his castle here. Wait, King Harvin? Can I use his key here? The cute key. Let's go! It's a skeleton man. Oh, it's just a... It's just a staff. What is it called exactly? Phantom Rod. The Phantom Rod reveals invisible walls, that's all. 
I thought I found something important. It probably is important, but... You need to have an instinct that there is invisible walls nearby. Otherwise, using it is a waste. There's the waterfall. And below it is uh, where we went to and found the cave. I like how connected this world feels. Alright, I'm glad I checked it out. I had a feeling that there was a, a closed chest. And also, while exploring and stuff, our strength did level up, so we strong. Alright, now which one of you leads to the castle? Is it Elhan's route? Or is it this route? I know there is three routes in total, but I believe one of these two around here should lead us to the castle. I believe this leads to the small mine. It's just a little hard to remember because there is so many paths. And they look kind of similar. Maybe within the th central village there is a passage, if I remember correctly. This is the elf seller. He sells things, not elves. He's not selling elves. This is the key maker and this is the dead end. Look at the map. Even if we look at it, I don't know how... Like... Because the places aren't... Located. You know? It's not gonna tell me this is the castle. It all, all looks the same on the map. And this is a dead, another dead end. Cool. That over there, small mine. Wait, maybe this leads to the castle? Oh yeah, this is the dead guy. He died. Fenrir guy. Oh my bad. No, it's a good idea. It's just... The, it's just that the execution would be difficult. I guess I should save the game. Hmm. Perhaps the central village has a way. I believe that has to be the central village then. There is another village nearby. I'll give it a look before going to the central one. Now we just need to find our way back. I believe it's... Oh my god. I believe it's through here somewhere. Yeah. I'll make sure to take a safer route. Can I close... I can! Now nobody can cross. Alright, I opened it back up. And this one to El Hunts. We'll check out El Hunts. There's a graveyard. Hmm. If I can't find it at El Hunts, we know it's in the central village. Elimination tactics. Hold on. Hold up, I think I found it. Hold on. Hold on.
Did I find it? No, that that's a hole. Yeah, I think it's uh, in the central, like I said. I it looked like there should be an... In Is it a trap? Okay, I said there should be like a... It looked like there should be an invisible wall here. And it seems like we found a crystal. I have quite a few of those, so we can probably sell them for a high price. Good, now I'm kind of disoriented. Wait, there's two paths. Wait, there, there's three paths. Uh, uh, I'll try this one. Another hole. As I suspected. Alright. We're heading back to the central village. Through it, there should be... A castle. There's the man over there. But before I leave, is there another path? There is. Hold on. Where does this path lead? Oh, a path that diverges to two. Alright. I already checked here. Alright then, central village it is. I don't know why it told, uh, my brain told me it should be around here. By the way, is there anything down there? Nope, it's a hole of death. I could try jumping. Well, I survived. The thing is, there is two bridges. We already jumped down one, but this is the second one. Oh, I found something! Of course it's locked. Come on. How many keys do I have? None of them work. Well, now I know there is something down here. Good idea to jump down a bridge. I mean, not the first thing I would do, but still a good idea, regardless. Wait, is it over here? Don't tell me it's over here. Yeah, I think this is the dead guy zone. Yeah. Alright, so it's not over here. Okay, it has to be the central village then. Are we recording this game on real hardware or is it emulated? It's emulated. Recording on real hardware would be a big issue because I, first of all, I would need to... <laughs> I would need to find the game at a reasonable price. And then, I would need to find a PS1 and then, I need to record the PS1 through a setup in the Elgato, And then, I would have to put the Elgato into adapters. Because Elgato does not accept anything other than HDMI. So, a very lengthy process setup. And also, I, won't, I wouldn't have save, save states. And this game likes to kind of, you know, kill you. Hold on. A wrong turn. I was uh, yapping. This is what happens when I yaps. The path is behind me. Rumbus key? Do you have a rumbus key? 
Oh, you again. When will you learn, old man? So, next to the central hub, there should be a termite village. But we want we don't want to go there. We're going to we want to find a way up to the castle. Give me that. Rumbus key. Rumbus key. Hmm. Take me to the village. I should pro try to probably equip the magic defense item against the fire guys. I might not get bursted instant instantly. Because they shoot about four fireballs in a row if you get hit directly. So maybe it would be a good idea. Just a thought that I'm saying out loud. Alright. So we need to kill him, cross a bridge, and then we'll be at the central village. He dead? Give me your money. You cannot create safe states in real hardware. Exactly. Maybe you could input a cheat code. Left down, upright, twist it. I can feel it. The castle is nearby. I can feel it. Though I would guess it does make for a magical experience. You know, playing this PS1 video game. This way leads to the termites, so we're not gonna go there. I mean, if I had this game for as a child, I would probably break the controller, but also it would be a very magical experience. I wouldn't break a controller. It, it's probably one of these games where it's really hard so nobody complete it, but Still magical times. This lead to the sentry. Hopefully the castle is nearby. In here maybe? This is, I believe, the gem guy? Yeah. I'm glad I remember that now. But also nearby there, I believe there is an entrance to the castle. Oh, I think I found it. Is that it? It goes down. I want it to go up. Why is it going down? Oh, I remember this place. Oh yeah, it's that place with, his, with a million doors. Hold on a moment. Not the place I wanted, but... Oh, it opens. I found a flask. A full flask. Okay. And then there was a secret door within a secret door. Over here there was a secret door. But it was empty. But over here there should be a secret door. And then behind the secret door, another secret door. That leads to a secret door with a secret door and a secret door. Never mind. Just one secret door. So now we use the silver key that I bought. R wrong key? How dare you?
I need to buy the key DLC to open this one. Come on, don't be like that. I probably need a gold key. The ruins of King Harvin's castle. King Harvin's castle? The Harvin key should work then. Okay, it doesn't work. And the silver key doesn't work either. The silver key worked earlier, but I guess this one requires a higher key. I, I'm not entirely sure. Though I still believe the castle is nearby. Maybe not through here specifically, but... Should be from somewhere. Oh, I think I, I found it. There it is. That's the path. Okay, that's why I was so confused. You need to go through the door and then turn around. 180 and then you can see the door. All right. <sighs> I think this leads to the other side. Let's see here. No, this leads to this uh, funny place. Chest broken? I don't think so. He just requires a very specific key. The flasker, that should be an achievement. The nest was one of the main offender here. The games I had were without saves, so you either sit your ass down and play from zero to a hundred, or start again from square one. Yeah, I mean, you gotta remember, the games were designed back with the mentality of arcade machines where they want to try to get you to die and restart over and over again because that's how they make money. Until it changed. But that that's how it was. Okay, so... Where exactly is the, the passage that I saw to the other side of the castle? I think it's through the castle. So right now we're inside Harvin's castle. The ruins of the castle. And there should be a way forward. I can now kill ghosts with two hits. So that's very convenient. There you go, just two hits. Nice. I believe this door leads outside the castle. Oh yeah, I was correct. Alright, time to explore. Oh, I'm being shot at. I'm... Each in my nose while being shot at. There is a grave there! That might be where Harris is! Other side of the island? Graves? That has to be it! Then you can give me some information about the big mine before we go down there. So there is two entry points to the other side. I could choose either or. I'm gonna choose the main one. Though there is a ghost. Who do we go for? The ghost first? Too many enemies. I need to go through them. I need to... Hold up. I need to line them up and fight them one by one. If I fight all of them, I'll lose. Uh, dodge. I don't know what that was, but it looks menacing and I don't want to get hit by it. Oh, another enemy from behind. Alright, I'll flank these two. I'll flank them. And now we can fight them one by one. I killed the two ghosts. Oh, I don't want to get hit by that. I was about to go in. But he was like, nah. About four hits to kill them. I leveled up, so now I do even more damage. 
Oh, he backed up, so I missed. We got this. I'm gonna target the right one. I'm bumping into something. Oh, that was a gravestone. Ooh. Did I kill him with three hits? I probably hit him earlier. Alright, so I saw something by the graves right here. What is it? So we have a dagger. We have a healing herb. And we have two antidotes as well as a hammer. It seems magical. Is that a staff? It's a battle hammer. I don't suppose it does more damage than the bastard sword. So let's go to strength and compare the two. 79 slash, 28 chop, and 7 stab. So now I switch between the weapons and compare the damage again. Chop 94, stab very low, and slash zero. Alright, I mean, I could roll with it. Technically, it's supposed to do more damage. Hmm, the soldier's grave. Whose soldier? What soldier? If it can help me kill the enemies faster, I'm all for it. Wait, there is only water on the other side. Is this the end of the island? Well, the only way we can get to the other side then would be to explore the castle. It's just really strong. All right, let's test the, the damage of the weapon. Oh, I thought he shot... He, did he shoot a ghost? It takes a, a long time to recharge. Ooh, two hits! It takes a long time to recharge, but if you hit it, you hit it. I think it shot a ghost at me. Hammer time. It is indeed. Wait, there is another path here that I haven't checked. Hold on. I missed. So they still died to two hits. Found another rod. I'll keep the phantom rod for now. I have three. I found some stairs. Where Where is that gonna lead? There's a save room right here, so... Save the game. I do hear shooting, though. I don't like that. I hear archers. There are human enemies around. Is that on the other side? I think it is. Let's drop down. That's the other side of the human village. The, and there is the switch. I see it. I see the switch. Two hits on the archers instead of four. Nice. I do have to recharge, though. I got some arrows, so I don't have to buy any. Though it chose one arrow, it's probably a cluster of arrows. There you go, if you remember... Actually, I'll just show you. To get to the central village, we took this path on the left. This path on the left... Wait. No, wait, this is different. Hold on. Yeah, this path on the left leads to the central village. So now you guys know where we are. So now we managed to open a way through, and we might be able to get to the other side of the island. That is great. I thought the only way across would be to use some sort of a wind crystal, because there is this wind... Uh, pillar of wind. This is a door, clearly. I can see that. And then we have another passage right here. This is some huge progress. I found something. 
I found a rumbus key. Don't mind if I do. The more rumbus key, the better. So I don't have to keep switching them. All right. I'm very happy with this find. Very, very happy. How much max HP I have? Hmm, if I use HP flask now, then I'll lose some efficiency, so I'm not gonna use it. The music changed. We're somewhere. The walls are different. Alright. I'm back. <clears throat> I'm back. Professional streamer is who I am. Professional streamer mistake? Absolutely not. Professional streamer doesn't make a mistake. Okay, so why does somebody leave in us in a hidden house? Why is this house hidden? Oh, because he's dead. Uh, I don't think the the jellies are strong. I just think the weapon is weak against the jelly. Right? If I switch to the bastard sword, it's probably gonna. Yeah, two hits. It's just that the hammer isn't good against jelly. Like, what are you squishing? Nothing. I found another scorpion bracelet. What's the point of that? I can equip two at a time. Though, does it increase my chances? Don't know. Hey, it was hidden and we don't, we don't complain about hidden rewards. Amazing animation, thank you. Double racist, double the resistance. I hope. Harris Carvito. Hey, we found Harris. Where is he? <laughs> God damn it, Harris, he left. I finally made it to the other side of the island and he's just gone. I gotta look for him now. I found more crystals to my crystal collection. I, I, f I feel like now we have enough crystals to warrant going back to the crystal maker and make some more flasks. I believe we have four now, so we can either craft two or maybe we have more than four. Maybe we have five. I don't want to look because I don't want to spoil the surprise to myself when I go back there. You don't look like Harris. Where's Harris? My father hasn't come home from three days. He said that he would find a big crystal this time. Harris went diving? No, that's great news. The guy who's supposed to explain about the big mine is inside the big mine. And he's probably dead. I'm sorry, kid. Your dad is probably dead. I want to go find him, but I'm very scared of the underworld. Leon is missing as well. What should I do now? They just left you here? I believe that dad is safe. So I go to the safe, to the small mine and he says, oh, if you want to go to the big mine, talk to Harris. And Harris is in the big mine now. Good job, Harris. Oh wait, Harris isn't her dad. I don't think so. Yeah. Harris just vacation, I guess. Harris is probably loitering around. He's probably loitering. Can I steal something from their house? I mean, he, her dad is not gonna stop me from stealing. I guess not. Alright, is she telling the truth? Gigi Budwell. She moved to the island with her father. Gigi is frequently sick, so she doesn't go out very often. She hopes to hear from Leon about his adventures. Leon Gigi.
When I find Harris, let me tell you, he's gonna get a, a beating. Oh, a hidden door. What is this? I found... Oh. Wait, this is the second time I find this tree. I remember. In the termites base, there is a hidden tree. And now if you look on top of the tree, there is a dragon crystal. Put one and one together. And it means you gotta pull out a bow. And hit that sucker out of there. Uh, did I miss or is it just stuck there? All right, I'm uh, I'm taking back my bow, my arrows. Okay, so not one on one. So how are you supposed to get it down from there? I can't climb there. All right, let's exhaust the talking options just in case it's important. I believe that is safe. Good. Give me that crystal. Don't think I forgot about these crystals. Stupid tree. Give me my dragon crystal. Hey, wh where did the dragon crystal go? Did I hit it out? Is it... Has it fallen? Who knows? Wait! It's so small! Why is it so small? Is the crest... Is it growing? It is growing! Okay, so you're supposed to come here occasionally and pick up Dragon crystals? Sure, I guess. So if that's the case, if that's how dragon crystals work, there is a way to replen replenish mana then. So is there a reason why this is a house without doors? Who built this house? Harris? Oh wait, the door is on the other side. We've been there, that's the house with the jelly. I guess. Any invisible walls here? I hear jelly, so I assume that's the house we've been in. That's the secret house, if we go here. Right? Right? Yeah, that's, that's that house. Get me out of here. Why wouldn't you tell me where Harris went? I think her dad... ...is Leon. I mean, that is her dad, but I think we met Leon in the small mine, didn't we? How did he know of Harris? Oh wait, is this a big town? You again. Sealed. Not accepted. The truth mirror on the kid. Because it gives me information. I use it on everybody I see. Probably I'll save that for a second. There is a sign there which I'm interested to read. Told you to stop hiding, Harris. Oh, that's big spiders. Wait, this was a human village. You can tell by this structure. Okay, I'm gonna fight these guys only inside the in inside small areas. There is no way I'm letting them jump. Two hits, really? What you need big legs for if you die? What's he gonna do? Jump to death? Night. Oh. You want a bite? 
Bite this? Wait, I'm still being shot arrows. Where from? Wait, there, there are humans. Why didn't they kill the monsters? Oh, fools, I'm coming up there. You have made such a big mistake. Where, where's my hammer? Where's my hammer? You made such a big mistake, you... Fools! Hey, is that a Rumbuski? Give that to me. Wait a second. Why you need a bow and arrow if you can use magic? What was that just now? Treeman? Oh. oh, I accidentally swung my weapon. God damn it! I'm being shot on both sides! This is literally the worst. I need to take cover behind one of them. Okay, this uh, hammer doesn't do well versus... Versus them. This is the worst. You move all around while shooting me. I'm actually gonna die. I already used the flask, but... This exchange was not favorable. Well, they're dead. I mean, a hammer is great and all, but it has too many downsides. Because I can't use it at the jellies, and these tree men are very susceptible. Get out of the way! I wanted to kill him before the the thing comes. Ha! Huh? He's shooting the, the ghost. Wait, I thought I, I'm hitting the ghost uh, two hits to kill. Oh, that's probably a special ghost. All right, let's explore. So this is a graveyard. Maybe I'll find Harris here. Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I see another ghost. Okay, he's not rushing me or anything. Danger, no exit. All right, I won't use the hole. Damn, there is too many things to do. I need to dodge and hit and dodge and hit. Ah, uh, he still hit me. There is two tree men. One behind me and one in front of me. Oh wait, is that not a hole? It, it's not a hole. Okay. I just noticed. It's uh, full. Wait, this guy dropped a magic increase? That's worth like 4,000 gold. That's insane. Oh, I guess that's a hole. I can see that. There you go. They, they died to three hits from the sword. Yeah, it's another cave without an exit. I'm not going to go down there then. Though we aren't in the correct place, we should find Harris, I believe. I believe Harris should be around here. Hmm. I hear more jellos. Strength gained. Thank you for the bloodstone. Also not a hole. 
Harris, you gotta be Harris. You came full crystals too. My leg was broken by falling rocks, which killed my friend at the same time. I'm taking care of his grave now. I couldn't find anything of value while I was out digging for crystals. Are you Harris? Hold on a moment. Harris, yeah, you're Harris. Harris Carvito, the first resident on this island. He was a skilled crystal miner before he hurt his leg. Now he lives outside the village, keeping his friend's grave. Everybody worked very hard, but the crystal that we found were barely enough to support our lives. The merchants take advantage of us. Also, we cannot go back to our country because this island is poisoned. Huh? How does that make sense? Like, are you poisoned and if you go back you poison everybody? Or is it the island keeping us here because it's poison or something? Yes, yes. Since I broke my leg, I haven't been into the mine. I can live through. I can live though, because my friend left me enough crystals. However, since Necron came to the island, he has made life very difficult for us. In the back, in the back, there are the graves of King Harvin's soldiers. The soldiers were left on this island after Harvin withdrew. Those poor soldiers had believed that Harvin would return for them. I can still hear their voices in my mind. Oh, so that's the ghosts. Recently, I have been dreaming of my youth. I've been told this guy can help me go uh, explain about the deep mine. He literally explained nothing. Alright, we'll fully explore this area and then I'll explore the, the the big mine on my own volition. I see a rumbus key over there. I'll go pick it up. Mining town. Alright, I'm gonna save, switch to save 3, save here. I'm also gonna switch to save 2 and save here. I'm gonna go into the place without exits. Oh, they weren't kidding. Oh wait, there is an exit. There is something in the water. It's an arrow. Another water crystal. So this is the second water crystal without an exit. Until I learn some sort of teleportation. There is no use in taking these. Oh, I see. So there were two holes. The other hole lead over there. I see. Well, if I find a guide post of some kind, or a crystal guide post of some kind, I would be able to teleport. See, there is a save point right here. They want you to put the crystal in the guide post and then teleport to it to get out. Oh, that's a water crystal I picked up uh, previously. I didn't use it. That's not the water crystal we just picked up. Um, this position. What is this position? I remember... Um, well, nothing really happened. Oh, this poison. I knew that. 
But wasn't that the crystal that without an exit? I remember we learned this poison from that. It's a little dark. There's the other hole. Oh, I didn't fall down. So this leads to the motorboat. Oh, there is a flying fish! Let him fly. Another magic increase damage. There this is. I will explore to see if there is a way out of here. I don't suppose there is though. Yo, what the That's creepy as heck. What is that? Flying fish head? He seems mad when he died. Don't move. <laughs> he took a bite. Why is he not getting hit? He's not he's he's not reacting. There you go. Stupid face. This seems important. I don't know what this is. The elf's grave? So you have a graveyard built on top of a graveyard. Hey, there's a dragon crystal. Maybe all the yellow trees share the same growth rate? Who knows? I don't think there is a way out though, so I'm not saving. Oh gee, a lot of elves died here. The elf cave should be nearby then, right? Nah, it's in the underworld. Yo, get the heck out of here. Ooh, I found a mist amulet or whatever this is. It's cool and all, but there is no way out, so... Until I find something to get me out of, uh, out of there. Then we're not really getting anything. I just don't know why he told me to go see Harris about the deep mine, and then he ju he does that where he's not saying anything. I don't know what was the idea behind that. Seems kind of ridiculous to me. Wait, they sucked my mana? I did not even pay attention. Mana hoarders. At least I stole the crystal from his... Uh, friend's grave. I almost fell down the hole. Hmm. Creepy faces. That's what they are. Mm -hmm. 
timber. Nice try. Ah, oh, he hit me. He hit me every single time he had a chance. So strong. Alright, I believe that's all of it. I was kind of hoping to get some direction into the big mine, but I guess not. I'll explore the rest of this area and then we'll head back there. At least we opened this eastern side of the island. At least we opened that up. Yo, what the heck is over here? Skeleton, you and your tricks. Damn, strong skeleton. Hmm, I know the hammer is good against the skeletons. And also, I'll use some HP. I think I'm able to actually use HP with a press of a button. The minus button. I don't know which button it is would be on the keyboard. So I'm not gonna do that. I'll set it up for next time though. Screw this skeleton guy. I don't think the hammer does good against the ghost. He does ag well against the skeletons, but not this ghost. God damn it, they're all guarding each other. Staying back now. Okay, I got him. And also, the dark is wearing off, I think. These are some really tanky ghosts. Give me that. Some more graves here. He's tanking the hits for the skeleton. Seems like we hit a jackpot though. I can see at least two treasure chests. We're gonna do a lot of hitting. Alright. I think we got through now. Another skeleton man. I think I'm gonna switch now to the hammer since there's only skeletons now. Oh no, they make me sneeze. I'm professional streamer, so you didn't hear anything. There you go, two hits. Get him out of here. Yeah, you don't like hammers, do you? Another moonstone. I found a map on one of the graves. Wait a second. I'll have to try and use a key. 
Not a Starkey. Not a Silver Key either. Hmm. Nope. I'm afraid we'll not know. There is a gold and a magician key which I do not have in my possession. I could try and buy them. I could sell the pirate key. Hmm. Either way, I think I'm done here. We found some important items. Hmm. And this leads to the main area of the graves. I see. Now, what was that other item? Miner's map. I see. To be frank, the miner's map could probably help me navigate the deep mine. Wait, I, re I don't remember this path. Can this guy take damage instead of dealing damage? Thank you. Maybe I don't remember this path because there were no enemies on it. That could be it as well. They're shooting at where I'm going. So I need I need to stop moving when they shoot. Hmm. Is there a way to get to the other bridge? That still hit me. <laughs> yeah, I don't suppose there is. So we'll go down there, check around. But I feel it's about time we check out the big mine. I leveled up. More damage, more HP, that's that's what I what I am. It's a damn risk, you almost sneeze your skeleton out. It's against the, the rules of the chat. I should probably kill the spiders before they start jumping. Damn, I'm missing. Alright. I believe either one of these paths were where we came from. Oh, a saving point. Don't mind if I do. I think it's this path we came from. Just confirming, just so I know where to look. Wait, no, this is not where we came from. So wait, if the other bridge is empty, then who was shooting the arrows? I'm so flabbergasted, I have no clue what the heck. Arrows shoot themselves. Yeah, right. Uh, what does this say? Base number three, we found it. We're missing three and four. But now we know where three is. So wait, where the heck did I come from? Maybe this, wait, there is another path here. Maybe I came from here. Yeah, I feel like I came from here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna use another flask. We have two more though. After that, we're gonna have to start using our or our uh, medicine. 
Oh yeah, great. Don't you have anything better to do than to sit in a room and shoot at a wall? You've been doing that all day. He kicked me. What the heck? Give me that. Outside I could hear them shooting. They were sitting here all day shooting arrows. What gives? Well, I've explored base number th three. I remember a guy saying he thinks there is six or five. We already found the fifth one. It has a chest that is locked. Though admittedly, when I found the chest, I did not have the silver key, which I've purchased. So that could be a game changer. That's it? Just a rhombus key? I'm not complaining, but I'm also complaining. All right, it's a rhombus key it is. They were guarding this rhombus key with their life. Actually, dummies. Hello, Rabu. Are you hacking right now? Alright, I'll kill these guys and I'll move on. If he hits me with an arrow, I'm gonna go all the way up there and hit him. He's now gonna miss on purpose. Alright, give me the money. I'm out of here. Now, where does this lead? Because I would like to explore this whole eastern part before moving forward to the big mine. Are, is this going to damage me? No, okay, so it's just a visual effect. I see. I could switch to the hammer for these guys. It's just going to kill them much quicker. Ooh, that, that's nice. That was nice to see. It does take longer to charge. The cemetery for the military guards of King Harvin III. Huh. So the King Harvin key could probably be of use here. I'm glad I found this hammer, even though it's not very good against most enemies. There is a lot of skeletons around the castle. So I'm glad for that. Is the chest empty? It is. I hear more of them. Okay, so this upper area is empty. Good to know. The question is, when am I not hacking? Good question. Is this a trap? Probably King Harvin's key would work here. That's a dragon stone. Wrong key! Were there two King Harvin's the thirds? Maybe jail key? Alright. Don't know what kind of key would go here, but... I guess uh, I get... I'm flabbergasted. Hammer time. Slow motion death. Strength gained. As if I wasn't strong enough. I'm now gonna smash their bones. I don't care how much milk they drink. Anti-milk. That's what my hammer does. Come on, get out of there, you stupid skeleton. Come on, you think I don't know you, that you're inside there? Alright. Is there another cha- uh, There is. Come, 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 come. Empty. I see. Empty. Soldier's grave. 
I found a bloodstone. Did he return it? Take it. He's a dead man. What, what is, what's he gonna use the bloodstone for? I found a secret door. I had suspicion. Are you telling me there was a hidden door for herb? Okay. Hello, Kero. Kron Gray. Hello. Hammer time. I think there might be an enemy behind me, so let's take care of business right here. Turn around. Oh, there was none. So it was just a sound. Hammer really is good for bashing. All right. Mandatory hidden door. <laughs> okay. It's just a hidden door and there's nothing here. It's it's just mandatory. They had to put it there. But there's literally nothing there, nothing on the ground. Oh, I guess I found a phantom rod. Scratch that. I stepped on it by accident. That's how I found it. Mandatory second hidden door? I don't think so. The second hidden door isn't mandatory. Alright, let me keep on exploring the grave. Found another bloodstone. I feel like there's probably an important key item around here. A grave. So, you just put a grave of somebody behind a hidden wall. I guess they wanted to... I guess uh, the guy who died here was shy. Yep. It's just a uh, crack behind a hidden wall. These hidden walls are mandatory. That's why funny things are behind them. Oh, you made a big mistake, buddy. I'm gonna break your bones. Dude died doing what he loved. Roaming around in circles. No skeleton? Suspicious. That's suspicious. An empty chest without skeletons. Oh, <gasps> that's the the expensive halberd that costs four thousand gold. It's an axe. I don't think I need the sword anymore. Then. Wait. It doesn't do a lot of slash damage, but the chop damage is pretty good. So, it's like an all-rounder weapon. Oh, I'm happy with this. It does a lot of uh, chop damage, so it also kills skeletons with two hits. I think I'm gonna roll with his hammer, f uh, with his, the Hellbird. I am gonna keep the the bastard swords though. Actually, I'll sell one of them, but I'll keep one for myself because it feels like the the weapons may have more utility. That's one. Okay, so that kills them with two hits. Nice. And the good news, it also recharges faster. So, technically, it's even more damage. Because of the fast attack. It charges very quickly. Oh, you can see a blight diamond stone over there. Give me that. I'm gonna save the game. Mandatory hidden door. Ah! I thought it's a trap. 
Uh, these kind of cabinets are usually for traps because they're wide. I found special gloves. So, armor. 50, 40, 46. And then I'm gonna switch the silver arms for the stone hands. 49, 45, 37. It's really not that better. Does it increase my magic defense? Nope. Alright, I'm switching it back. I know the silver... I know the silver arm also costs 4,000 gold, so... Wait, I found a hidden door. Another one. Hey, open up. The genie's out of the bottle. I already saw it. I cannot unsee it. I guess I'll use another potion, because I, I don't have that much health. I got a hit in the back. That's why. The King's Key worked here. Is it an enemy? Oh, it's another... He Magic upgrade. If I sell all of them at once, I'll have a bajillion money. But I think I would rather use them because... I think at the end game, just like the first game, you'll need a special magical attack. And to do that, you need a certain amount of magic power. Wait, did I find a key? I thought I saw something in the ground. Like a rhombus key. Guess not. Oh, that's that hidden door. Okay. Any other mandatory hidden doors? I'm glad looking behind the mandatory hidden doors paid off. <laughs> Is this the way back or are both ways leading up? Yeah, okay. So, I believe this is the way forward. Look up. Oh, I see something. Is that Harvin's castle? No, it's another lighthouse. And it seems that there is a spell up there. Wait, look at that. Behind the, the lighthouse, there is something there. You see that? Is that a... Is that a weapon? Like a... Like a cannon? Wrong game. I don't think they had this kind of power in, med in medieval times. Wait, am I supposed to drop down? I might be able to drop down and survive the fall, but I don't think I'll be able to reach over there. So I think I'll jump over here. I'll save the game. Nope, that's an insta-death. That's insta-death. So you're not supposed to jump down. Wait, you're, a you're allowed to jump forward like that, but you're not allowed to jump left? Okay, that's weird. So I had to go forward and then I, I can turn. I'm not gonna save though. What is this? The Samurai's Grave. I found a Samurai Sword. The Shiden. Oh, that does a lot of slash damage! 135! A message from the East Land. Rest in peace here. This would have been fine if I knew teleportation, but I don't. So, I'm gonna have to return this- <gasps> That's a green shield! I don't have that. I want- I want the shield. All right, I, I gave the, the sword back. Man, the moment I find a guide stone, I'll like so many secrets open up. Well, I believe we explored everything. I think it's time we go to the deep mine. The big mine. Big, it's a mine and it's big. Big mine. Anything else I've neglected to look? Nope. I'm very happy with what I found here. Wait, there is more. Hold on. Wait, no, there is less. Wait, but what about the King's Key? Did it not work here? 
King, 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 king. King. Wrong key. I guess down there, Harvin soldiers up there. And uh, and up there is some people, I guess. Some, some random people. Who knows? Oh, this weapon is nice. I'm glad I found it. Um, I do hear some more skeletons though, so probably a hidden wall, maybe? You know what? I think we're ready to investigate the castle, not the big mine. Because the castle was pretty tough, but if I put my magic resistance armor, and I have a weapon that gets rid of uh, skeletons quickly, I think this should be a, a winning combination. And I also remember where it is, I think. I think that's the door out of here. This is to the village. Yeah, okay. Mapping this place out. I am disappointed that Harris did not give me any pointers on what to do. Let's hope it has more reach. I mean, it's a long halberd. Probably does. Probably. Let's put a asterisk next to the... It does. <laughs> Alright. So, where exactly? A chamber next to the central hub and then turn around once you go through a door. That's what I remember. Wait, base three? Uh, base one, not base three. Hold on, this should be another door then. Yeah. And then turn right, turn right again. Continue going left, no. There it is. It's a little conv convoluted, but I remember the path. Found it. Live through the door. 180 degrees. <laughs> I, I can see why I was so confused on how to get here. It really is quite a labyrinth. Hold on a moment. I am making a mistake. I should probably go back to the village. Since this is the village for with the cr crystal guy. He should be able to craft some more flasks for me. And then I, I should refill them. The flasks really came in clutch. They really did. They made the expedition ten times more easy. I did not have to rely on healing herbs. Always the relying on healing herbs made me feel very anxious. Felt like I was always running out of them. So the... He's here. Yeah, I, I remember the layout. The bow is very, is really useful. <laughs> he just wants me to craft arrows, but I already have 48 arrows. Just from k killing archers. So, how many crystals do I have? I have eight? Wait, no. I have crystal flasks, eight. I have nine crystals, so I can craft four more. I have so many crystals, uh, flasks. I have so many flasks. I guess you're expected to craft bows, or maybe you're not supposed to fight this many bowsmen because they're strong, but I just rushed them. I rushed them when I had a small dagger, and now I can rush them when I have a big halberd. I really do not care, uh, care for them. Though I really wish there was a quicker way to refill this. There you go. This will increase it a bit. I think there is a quicker way to refill it. Hold on a moment. Equipment button minus. And then I select this. And now I look for that button. Yeah. 
Okay, I found a quick way to refill it. I refilled all of them. All right, so U is minus. Like the PlayStation minus. And now we switch it with the blue one. So now we can use them without opening the inventory. All right. Turn off the frame rate. Acceleration. Save the game. What is bro playing? We're playing Kings Kingsfield 2. All right, we have everything we need. Look at that max HP though. 210, remember I started with 50. We came quite a bit of a way. All right, now back to the castle. Though it may be a little dark because if I want magic resistance, I'm gonna equip my dark armor, which makes me unable to see very well and also makes it so that I cannot use spells to see well. So, you know, I'm not allowed to negate any status effect caused by the armor. It is a cursed armor piece. Maybe if we find a priest in the game, maybe he'll uncurse it. Who knows? Who am I kidding? It'll forever remain cursed. We are good. Our strength is 53 and magic power 37. Good. So now we're gonna go into Harvin's castle. I'm not entirely sure what we're gonna find, but it, I feel like it makes sense that we explore the top side of the island. And once we explored all of it, we're gonna go to the big mine. Because from what I understand, that's where the bulk of, you know, the stuff is. And also Harvin's key is gonna work everywhere. I am gonna switch to a different armor piece when I am gonna go. Wait, I can go to the sides here. Hmm. They just shooting. They spit in mad bars, let me tell ya. They're spitting street fire. Alright. This place used to be brimming with skeletons. What happened? I guess, uh, I guess I found a hammer, huh? Oh, uh, there they are. All right. Oh, did I just one-shot him? I mean, of course I did. I'm getting stronger. That's what's going on. Out of the way, pleb. Even the nice guys I'm killing with two hits. They're not really enemies, but... I mean, they do give you sometimes antidote. Though I do have a double bracelet key. Or scorpion. Double s scorpion bracelet. Oh, I see. That's all the way around the inner side. Yeah, so now we're on the other side of the faces. There is uh, faces from both sides, but that's what it is. Don't know what really these are used for. Alright, I'm gonna equip... I'm gonna switch the night plate for the dark armor. And now instead of having 6-7 magic defense, I now have 24, 12, 19, and 33. That's nice. We have some good fire de magic defense. We took some damage and I managed to avoid some. So wait, I can open this door. I could have walked around. I did not have to walk through it. The castle of the great ruler of the northern continent, King, Har King Harvin III. Alright, I could probably switch out my dark armor then. I was not needed to do whatever you saw me do just now. Wait, is a knight or a... Yeah, I think the knight plate is better. Don't ask me why. Oh, it's locked. Did I, did I not open this before? Maybe I did it and I loaded a previous save. Maybe that's what happened. Alright, I'm just gonna... <laughs> this key's so cute. It's like a A and it's like... Ha! Like it clearly has eyes. I know it's this insignia of their 
place, but it clearly has eyes. The insignia makes it look like eyes. Oh yeah, they're supposed to come from... Oh wait, he was camping? Absolutely not. Two hits. That's what you get. Last time they took four hits each. Is it following me? Oh, it's just standing there. I thought the projectile is gonna chase after me. There you go, that's much easier. There should be an enemy in the one of the walls. I did see a ghost. Is that skeleton without a head able to summon ghosts? This guy can shoot. He's in the other corridor. Oh, 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 oh. that's a wind cutter attack. That's a magic that I know as well. Alrighty then, I'm leaving. We'll go to the main corridor, but there is quite a bit of uh, dangers there, let's just say. Don't like it when they follow you? I mean, that's their nature, their skeleton. What's, what else are they supposed to do? Not be creepy? <laughs> How much max health I have? Okay, so if I use a healing potion, I will be wasting some 20 or 30 HP. I need to lose some more HP to gain the full 100. Because you get 100 HP if you heal. Ooh, that was a fire fi uh, straight to the face. This guy is insane. I think I gotta use uh, a healing item. I mean, there's not really much I can do. This place is a corridor, so... I don't really have much option. I'm gonna stay close so he does only physical attacks. There you go. I take damage, guaranteed, but less damage. Than getting a full straight fire attack to the face. He wasn't really guarding anything, so now I know. I will check the other side, though. Uh-oh. No. I do know that friendly fire is on, so if I stand behind one of them, they're gonna hit each other. I need to push through, though. Get behind one of them. So if they shoot, they shoot each other. Okay. Gonna stand behind this guy, then. Uh-oh. Stand behind this guy! He took the fire attack for me. I'm gonna try and kill him now. He's dead! Oh! He died exactly when the fire attack was coming my way, so I could not avoid it. God damn you and your shooting abilities! You have a sword! Use it, dummy! Damn it, and stop going around in circles! I can't hit you! Or I guess I can? There you go, I healed. I drank without opening the inventory. Another empty room? Yeah, I call baloney on that. Really? They were guarding an empty room? Well, what about this? Is this empty? What is that sound? Did I open something? What is that sound? Is it above me? I guess it's the skeleton shooting something. Welcome back, Lux. Alright then. Oh yeah, this is where the, I got shot by the Cobras. I'm switching back, I think, to my... Dark armor. They should fire, so I should be okay. Yo, what the heck are they? They're demons. A lot of fire. Wow, so much fire. God damn it. I'll take cover here for a second. Oh! 
The Dark Armor are really doing some work right now. They're like genies. They go back into a bottle. I one-shotted this jelly. I'm gonna drink. Alright, I have 151 health. Did I miss him? Ideally, I would like to not get physically attacked because I have less physical defense. I have more magical defense with the dark armor, but less physical. Oh. Uh, well, I can't really dodge those. They're just... on top of me. Get back to your genie bottle. Well, good thing is that we found a lot of flasks, so... I can just use them. Alright, what did we find? Found a moonstone. A godly screwdriver. What is it? It's the strangest screwdriver I've ever seen. Oh, it is! It's, it's a demon's pick. Do I pick lock demon doors? Is it a usable item? Does it disappear when I use it? It did disappear. Okay. Well, I'm gonna load a previous save. I have it. I guess I'll ask the fortune teller. I'm clueless. What's a demon peak? Does it just opens a random chest if I want? I used it on nothing. I do want to see though, so I'm gonna switch back to my night plate. I'll switch back if there is more fire enemies. I am happy with how strong we are though. Enemies are dying quickly. If we can kill the enemy quick enough, they can output a lot more damage. So by killing them quickly, we get a lot of damage. What is that? There is a photo there. Probably of the king. So we managed to fully explore the castle? I'll go straight for the painting. I'm curious. That's King Harvin? You are an intruder in my castle, therefore you must die. Huh? Ah! <laughs> Alright, one enemy at a time. First of all, I think I'll switch back to my dark armor. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, these are too many attacks. I gotta survive this. No choice but to fight! Damn, they're really strong, they're not dying! I healed. Okay, one of them died and I leveled up. I don't know how many there are. Oh, they're shooting each other now! I lined them up. They're lined up. His comrades actually killed him by accident. Nice. I healed again. Lined him up, lined him up. All right, it's only it's a one on one now. I healed again though. I healed again. He does a lot of uh, physical damage because I don't have physical armor. Alright. They're all dead. 400 gold? Damn! Well, well, well. Would you look at that? You are intruder in my castle. Sealed? Oh! 
I, I literally broke it. This looks familiar. What is it? Is that something a wind crystal? Yeah, it is. Do I know now wind magic? Magic learned. Missile shield. Okay. I found another one of these keys. I believe that's everything in the castle. Hmm. That's a lot of gold. It is, Eugene. I found a hidden chamber within the king's... Wait. Open up. Alright, I think it's finally time we head back to the mine. There is probably other chambers where the monsters came from. But I don't suppose there is anything in there. Yeah, I don't see anything in there. There is one chamber missing though. Where? Here? Yeah. And final check. Yep. That's crazy. It said sealed and then I broke the painting. Can I break the other tombs? I recall seeing like sealed the things or something about not accepted. Well, that was the castle. Now the next big thing is the dinosaurs. The dinosaurs know magic really well. All too well, if you ask me, suspiciously well. Okay, there's still fire in that. Are they powerful? The dinosaurs? Yeah. The thing is, the dinosaurs' magic attack, they shoot four at a time, and they follow you. So if you try and take cover, they follow you around the cover. They don't go th uh, and hit the cover, they go around the cover and hit you. So every time they shot four of them, I died. And there is about eight dinosaurs. As soon as you land down, there is eight dinosaurs around you. So if each one decides to shoot, not fun. At least, I think there is eight. There is one at the hall, and then there is three on the right side. So I assume there is another three on the left side. So, about seven. <laughs> but, it'll be fine. I'm sure of it. Now that I have the dark armor, now that I know what the dark armor does, I did not have magic resistance before, but now that I do, I might be able to survive the four hits. And if I get close enough, I don't think they shoot anymore. I think they start fighting physically. And physical attacks is my thing. Alright. Man, that was a lot of fun, actually. So now we need to go back to the North Village. And at the North Village, there is an entrance to the Big Mine. So that's where we're going. Because I believe we explored everything on the top side of the island. So now we need to find stairs. Uh, where are the stairs? Maybe on the other side. Now we need to find stairs. Though admittedly, it would be nice... Oh wait, not stairs. I already, I already used the stairs. Now we're going back to the central city. I don't think I have enough crystals for an another flask, do I? Yeah, I do not. Alright. So what we'll do is that we'll do a quick refill of the crystal... 
excuse me, of the flasks. And then we'll move on ahead. There should be a fountain nearby. I'll use it myself. And then we'll go to the menu. Equipment. Minus button. And then put the empty flask. Now I'm able to use the minus button to refill the flasks. There's about 10 of them. Nothing happens. Did I refill all of them? I guess we'll see. Yeah. Man, that option of just uh, assigning an item to a button. That's so handy. And I also found another dragon crystal. So I should be fine at that front. This is to the termites. I don't want to go to the termites, I don't think. Or is it? No, no, that's not to the termites. That's to the big mine. Okay. It should be able to go down the bridge. <laughs> These guys gave me such a hard time at the beginning. I'm so glad to see them fly as soon as I, I as I just think of hitting them. Use the dragon crystal? I think you mean the dragon stone? I have two of those and I think I need three of those. We need to find another cave within the big mine called the elf elf's cave. And within the elf's cave, the dragon stones are used. Still a problem, I see. And I also found a bunch of rumbus keys, so I should be fine. So if you look at this sign... Hold on. The entrance to Big Mine. Oh, this is gonna be troublesome. I could also finally explore the part with the shooty guys. I remember I got shot by demons. This, this path right here had demons on it. I could equip the magic and take care of them. I guess not exactly here, but probably next. Wait. I don't need to switch armor. I'll just try and kill them without getting hit. Wait, they took more than one hit? What, what gives? Either way, I don't think I need to switch. I'm able to hit them before they hit me. Oh, there goes all my health. <laughs> I, I was too lazy to switch. What can I say? I found a crystal, though. Are you able to actually get to the other side? I wonder. Let's actually switch to... Watch out! Ooh, that hit me in the head. Hold on a moment. I actually survived. There is archers here, which means this is a new area. Is this base number four? Is that it? Base number four, yeah, okay. Go! I'm gonna ransack this place. Wait, what's this? A thermostat? Really? Okay, wh why would medieval people need a thermostat of some kind? I think I did something, I just don't know what I did. I probably turned off the fire faces at Harvin's castle and at the area with the, the demon. If I had to guess. I, I have four rumbus keys, I'm good. You door camper. Wait, I missed? Out of the way, door camper. Alright, I'm gonna save the game and I'm gonna try and use uh, wind magic. Oh, I can do a shield! <laughs> I fell down. Was I walking in the air for a second there? It looked like I was walking in the air for a second. Also, there is a door here. Okay, not gonna lie, this is obnoxious. I'm gonna... 
Okay, I wasn't walking on air. Good. I thought I was walking on air, but I wasn't. What's down here? I'm not gonna save until I know what's down here. It's very dark. Invisible wall, okay. Woohoo! Demons! They were guarding the chests, but is there a way out of here? Let me see. I don't know where I am. All right, I'm gonna load. I'm not gonna go there. I don't know if there's a way back. You know what? I'm, I better start creating backup saves as well. Just in case I somehow screw this up. In case I can no longer go back. Uh, this looks familiar. Is that where the archers shot at me? Yeah. So we don't need to jump down. Oh, actually, I think to get down there, we do need to jump down. Because it's up there, the entrance. Yeah, the entrance is up there. Okay, I see, I see. So we do need to drop down. Alright. I agree. I agree to the terms. I'm gonna drop down there. I'm gonna use a rumbus key, though. Check through your inventory. Uh, I do have a map, I just don't really know what things on the map are. Because the map doesn't show items or anything, or what locations are. Did he just drop a flask? Okay. Besides, I don't know even what the name of this place is. I have two maps. I have a minor map and I have an island map. But I think best way to remember is the layout. Because I don't think I'll remember just by looking at the map alone. Yeah, I think I found another flask. I saw that I had another flask in the inventory. I think I used one and it said I had two empty. Which means... Uh, Hold on, let me deal with them first. They're gonna shoot fire at me. Ooh, this really hurts. Okay. Use healing again. This was not fun for my character. I found a crown. This seems important. Where is it? Do I equip it? Blood crown. This seems ominous as hell. I'll try. I'm bleed. Oh, I'm not bleeding. Oh, look at my magic defense. Yo, that's insane! Not dark magic, though. Uh, dark magic and water magic, not so good. But fire, earth, and wind? I have Im insane magic defense now. And that's without the dark armor. If I go ahead and put the dark armor... I have ridiculous magic resistance now. Almost more than physical resistance. Nice! Man, that was a nice find. 
I'm gonna unequip the dark armor though. We don't need that. It's gonna give me a good... Hmm... Is it cursed though? I don't know. Will my character magically die? It is called Blood Crown, so... It says my condition is good. But I'm suspicious, guys. That's all. I know there is some sort of a trade back. A uh, trade off. Hello, Otman Tayak. You do have maps. Maybe those could help. I mean, I'm, I'm not really lost. If I'm lost, maybe. But I'm exploring. And again, I feel like I know the place better if I remember the layouts rather than uh, look at the maps. I hear arrows, so that means that this is the way out. <laughs> Classic. I'm gonna go back inside and uh, I'm gonna explore the other side. I'm gonna heal myself while walking. Oh! 500 gold! I hear screaming. Oh, fire demons back. They want their blood crown. All right. I'm happy about this. I don't know if it reduces my physical resist uh, resistance by a tiny bit, but it, it's so small that it's totally fine. All right, now we have to deal with the archers. Where are they? Oh, the gold. I killed them already. That's what happened. I killed them and didn't pick up the gold. I was so puzzled, perplexed. I was so perplexed about that hole. I mean, you fall down a hole and then there is a door there. Why is there a door inside a hole? That's suspicious. My brain was working overtime to figure that out. That it's a very suspicious thing. I do hear a lot of fire, so I'm glad I found this blood crown. I hear, like, rapid fire. And I did go to base number four and reduce the thermostat from fire to water or whatever. So you would think there would be less fire, but... Oh well. I mean, I do want to explore the big mine, but I guess the big mine can wait. I want to figure out what's going on over here. And I am checking these pockets for invisible walls. Um, why am I slow? Okay, it was a frame rate thing. I thought the blood, the, the blood crown is doing something. I am still suspicious of the blood crown. How many rumbus keys do I have? If I have at least two, I'm fine. I do. Oh, I need another one to go forward, though. Is there an invisible wall here? Nope. No rumbus key on the ground. Alright, I might not be able to leave if I don't find any more. So I'm not gonna save for a little for a few seconds. First of all, we're gonna use the rumbus key. I can go further deep. Is he bad? He looks nice. How did you get here? The man named Ernest came through the back. He seemed to be looking for someone, but only Necron soldiers are around, around here. He can sell this. Wait, he's selling the bastard sword for more? Bastard. I can buy a great elm. Crystal guard. Yo, look at that price though. About 20,000 gold. 
I feel like I shouldn't buy anything. These guys are thieves. 23,000 gold. Or 24,000, almost. He's selling a dragon crystal as well. Yo, why is a phantom rod cost 15,000? I have four of those. You want one? Where's my phantom rod? Oh, he sells it for 15,000, but I, when I offer one? Oh no, you know what? It's actually worth 950. Yo, screw off, you bastard. They weren't kidding they, when they said the elves are stingy. Now I see why. El Hunt really did warn me about the elves. I did not listen. Am I buying or selling? I can buy a demon's pick. No clue what he does. I will ask a fortune teller when I see one. Bastard, that's what you are. I'm robbing you. Out of the way. I want to rob. Hiya! He's so small I missed. Alright, probably shouldn't mess with him. So like, what, do I die if I go through that door? Wait, there is no door to go through. What? Oh, did I save the game inside here? Well, I do have a backup save. I hope I didn't. I could save the game in here as well. So, we should find some rumbus keys around. Oh no, that's a dead end. No rumbus? Please tell me there is a rhombus key. I had like four of those and it's still not enough. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna have to go back, like load a previous save because I'm stuck. I am sure that Necron has the King's Sword. I want to get it back, but there are too many enemies around here. Beyond the room guarded by the Copper Knights is the passage made by the Mage of Fire. It was made with fire magic, so fire power is sealed. By the way, I couldn't find our soldiers. Where is everybody? Oh my god! Just a single rumbus key is all I need to get out of here. Just a single one. Oh my gosh. Well, I want to go and fight the archers, but I don't even get an option to do that. There is, a, there is no door there. What the heck? Give me my rhombus keys back. Uh, all right. Where are we? Are we inside? Yep. All right. I'm going to have to load a previous save file. Uh, so do I still have the blood crown? Sorry. I did not think we we're going to get locked like soft locked. I do not have the blood crown. Well, I know where it is, at least. And I know how to get it. Yo, really good thing I created a backup file. Otherwise, I feel like we would have been going way, way back. I had four. I was so confident I'm just able to explore. Oh, wait. It's right here. We didn't, we didn't miss much. I thought uh, I'm all the way back at the central village. Okay. And there is no rhombus key here. How many do I have now?
You know what I could do? Hmm. I think I could do the whole shenanigans with the demon again. But I think instead of going forward, I'll take the key from the back and then go forward. That way we'll have the extra rumbus key to get out. So, heal. Um, way forward. Oh, yeah. It's a hidden wall. Rush! Rush them! Oh, I got stuck. No, this is a good time to get stuck when you're fighting two enemies that shoot you. Yes. Good time to get stuck. God damn it, all they had to do was put the one rumbus key down to make sure that the player can get out, but... I guess they thought I could teleport out. Or something. Maybe we missed a teleportation ability somewhere, because I get stuck so many times. Like, we had to delete the... Technically, delete the save file, like, three times already, because we went into a room and then there is no exit. Hmm... Let me open this. 500 gold. I'm gonna... S oh shit. I saved and saved uh, two. Alright. Uh, it should be fine still. I still have one more backup save. The archers are alive. Damn it, he's shooting into the future. He's shooting where I'm going. Damn you. How is he already out over there? I'm making him shoot to the right by going right and then stopping to go right. A, a third archer? Where did he come from? They have long hands, let me tell you. The moment they reach their hand back, they already shoot. Wait, no rumbus key? Really? You need like 50 to go in here? Sounds kind of ridiculous. How many rumbus keys do I need? I had four when I entered. How many more do they want me to have? What's over here? It's nothing. There's nothing here. I don't understand. I guess I'm supposed to go to the deep mine and look for more rumbus keys? Is that it? I think I have one extra rumbus key to go forward. Never mind. I have one extra rumbus key to go forward, but not to go back. So if we don't find rumbus keys. Oh, wait! There is really nothing here. Never mind then. I'm loading the save then. Because just by the virtue of moving forward, I lose rumbus keys. So I w how do you enter this room? If not from there. I don't see a hole. It has to be an invisible wall and it's not from the left side or f from the front side. So it must be the wall where the... Oh. <laughs> he hit me around a corner. How did he hit me around a corner, man? Do I have a huge head? Anyway. So... Where the chest is at, there should be a, a hidden wall. But... I don't see no hidden walls. Damn it, not enough rhombus keys, stranger. At least I did find a blood crown, so I'm happy for that. 
I'm gonna equip it. We'll need more rhombus keys to get, to continue, but oh well. I will have to leave, uh, I think, two rhombus keys behind because I cannot take this rhombus key with me. There you go. Yeah, he really did dr drop a flask. I'm not. I was not imagining it. Like there is no option to pick it up and then go with it. It's a uh, rhombus keys, uh, keys that I'd have to leave behind, but if I find more, I can use them. So it's fine. It's uh, if I leave them behind. These guys get to shoot up there because I cannot reach them. There's probably... There probably is a way forward, I just... I'm unsure of where it is. Wait! Did the trap stop? Yeah, the trap stopped. What, what stopped it? Was it because I was able to go go through? Interesting. Man, they're sh sniping me. Open the door. All right, this is the area with the demons. I do have the crown equipped, so I should be fine. I don't know how to make a bridge. I ha I know some wind magic. Oh, I thought the thermostat turns off these faces shooting fire. Are they homing attacks? They sure are. Oh yeah, give me all the homing attacks. Why won't you? I, I thought I turned them off. Why do they keep shooting me? Alright. So maybe you need something else. Like a magic shield. That I have. So I'm gonna use it. Just go, 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 go. Use magic. Missile shield. Wait, did you? He he didn't use the magic. Hold on. There you go. I could probably get close enough. Wait, I'm still losing HP. What? Well, uh, missile shield. What missiles are you blocking? I'm still getting damaged. No, my whole sapphire deleted. No. Anyway, we're back. Oh man, that is ridiculous. Do they want me to equip the... Dark armor as well? Maybe we just try and rush? Is that it? We rush past the bridge and see if we can find a way to turn off the, f the fire phases? Heal? I healed. Can I kill the phases? Oh, he's still shooting me! Oh my god, yeah! Let's put more enemies to shoot, why won't you? Where, 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 where did this guy come from? Just magically appears and takes all my HP away. Thank you. Wait a second. What? The underworld prison. There is a turn off trap here. So I guess the thermostat was for the traps. I see. Yo, what is this? I'm taking off my dark armor. I gotta see this. It's just a bunch of crystals. I do not have a rhombus key, I think, to go forward. Oh, 
What did I find? Iron gloves? They don't seem as strong as the silver arms. Yeah, they weak. They weak, man. Yeah, they're very weak. I'm not, not equipping them. They're shooting me! They're curving the arrows to the... Enough of your sh sh shenanigans. You tell me they can curve them around stairs, but not shoot me from point blank. Makes sense, dummies. Anyway, I killed them, so they should never spawn again here. So I'm saving the game. I'm gonna heal. How much healing do I have left? Let me check. I used a bit. I have five more. Nice. I'm losing HP. What? I just lost HP. I saw the number go down. Yeah, I'm losing HP. What the heck? It's the Blood Crown, guys. It's the Blood Crown. I told you. It's a cursed item. I knew it. I know it's cursed. I know it. Anything with magic is cursed. Magic is an abomination. Heal? Because you're getting shot behind by a goddamn tank. Royal Treasure House. Alright, I'm putting the blood... Uh, I think the blood crown is a lot less damage. And also... Dark Armor. Okay, I'm good. Open the chest. Open it. Oh my god, you want me to walk into the fire to open the chest? Good. That's exactly what I wanted. Alright, and say I'll save and save too. Even the enemies cannot move, man. Embarrassing. Use magic, heal. I cannot use magic to heal. Use magic, heal. Empty. Cool. All right, cool. Empty. A hundred gold. All right, I got it. I'm taking off the blood crown now. Oh, this seems important. It's locked. Uh, where'd you come from? Stop Swiss washing all over the screen. Let me kill you. Is he taking damage? I don't know. Okay, he took damage there. Thank you. Now let's try one of the many keys. Harvin keys worked. A thousand gold. A magical lamp. The magician's lamp. It's dark right now because... Because the fireball hit me in the face. It's dark right now because that's a status condition that I took from the ghosts. 
I'm out of I'm out of healing items. I guess I'll use the healing herbs. Locked. Am I dead? I think I'm dead. Cool. That was fun. A magic ball that two shots you. I'm losing HP. I have the thin equipped. Come out. I know you're in there. When I ask you to use a magic heal, please use it. Thank you. And then... I'll use a uh, herb. I'm about full HP and now I'll switch to magic defense and I'll try and open the chest. So... Blood Crown, and then Dark Armor. Save the game. Go, 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 go! I got a hit, but I'll try the King's Key. It worked! I got a magic uh, spell. It actually worked. Oh, he's doing a lot less damage now with all, with all this magic resi resistance. All right, I'm leaving. I'm leaving this place and I'm not looking behind. Actually, did I loot everything? Yeah, okay. Just made sure, wanted to make sure that this is looted. Without the blood crown, I don't think this would have been possible. Oh, I'm out of flasks. Whoa, I'm being shot at. I think the correct move here is to switch to Earth Herbs, use them, save the game, and now try and take the, the last item. Oh, too many, too many. Healed again. I healed again by using like five herbs right now. It's locked. Okay. I used another five herbs. Stand in front of the chest and use the king's key. I got it. Oh, I got another stargate. I don't really know what that does. Alright, get me out of this. Get me out of this place. I'm almost dead! They're killing me! Gee, I hate homing attacks so much. I think we have to go back to the village and refuel on supplies, because this took so much. First of all, let's get rid of the blood crown. It's just constant barrage of damage. Everything shooting at you. No chance to fight it or do anything. Oh, man. These faces outside did a lot more damage than inside the king's treasury. Um, open up, please. We should be close to a village, so... We can refill our...
flasks. We also got one extra flask from exploring. Oh, I think we already refilled the extra flask though. After returning from there. All right. Uh, one of these paths should lead outside. Rumbus key, rumbus, rumbus, there you go. I have only one, but it's enough. Oh, did I say it's enough? Actually, there should be a village nearby here. I can return the rumbus key. There you go. And also... Ahead of time, I'll switch this with the empty flasks. Oh, I can switch it with spells as well. Nice. Interesting. 14 flasks. Damn, that's a lot. That's a lot of flasks. I'll take the rumbus key here. Alright, I can switch now to my main save. Save one, save two, and save three. Because we got some important items. He caught me, but I, I don't take that much damage. Those fireballs are pretty fast. It's not the problem that they're fast, it's the problem that they're homing, that they're after you, so dodging isn't really gonna happen. I needed some sort of a fire shield. I have a wind shield, but didn't really do much. Or a shield missile, whatever that is. But uh, all wells ends well, because we're good. How many... Herbs did I use though? May want to go back and purchase some herbs. Damn, I used more than half. Or not more than half, uh, less than half. Damn. They really came in clutch. So I may want to consider going back to All's Hut and buying more. Uh, there should be a fountain. And there should also be a shopkeeper around here, so maybe I can buy here. I would like to shop at the Owls because it's so cheap, but oh well. Okay, I refilled all 14 of them. So now we go equipment and switch it with the full ones. There you go. Now I believe there should be a shopkeeper here. We can use flex tape too solve our problems yep that's a lot of damage oh gosh where is the shopkeeper hmm I do have a lot of gold I'm happy about that about 8,000 that's not insignificant I found all these interesting items, but I still haven't found a guidepost item to teleport me. That's a problem. Uh, shopkeeper. I just want to buy some herbs. So this is the child and the woman. I believe might be a shopkeeper around. A lock chest. We'll see about that. I don't suppose it's a pirate key. Let's try the silver key. That worked. A moonstone. Well, moonstones are very valuable. They restore magic. Might be important for endgame stuff when I need magic the most. Not accepted. A 
I'll buy like... Hmm, I'll buy enough earth herbs to reach 50 in total. They really came in clutch. They really saved the day. So I want to keep them in case I need more. So over here is the crystal guy. I need a shop guy. Does this happen to be a shop? It does not. And this is to the castle. <laughs> you can't enter. I'd appreciate if you tone it down a bit with the spam. Hmm, I'm gonna go to... Either there is another side... Or... I don't know where the shopkeeper is. Maybe he's here? Oh. He might be here then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is a shopkeeper here. Or at least the there used to be. Where'd he go? The shopkeeper moved. He does it on purpose. Even though I stand here all day, I have a lot of information. The crystal miners come here for food and I get my information from them. You can't go to the East Ocean because the bridge isn't ready. It's not so important though. The cave of the pirates is on the we West Ocean. You didn't know that, did you? A man is hiding near the South Village. His name is Fai. I told you that I know everything. He has valuable items, but he never sells them. Sandler told me that there is a castle-like building. Did you know that? Anyway, if you find anything, bring it to me. A castle-like building. So Sandler wants something that I picked up? Did you know that? Anyway, if you find anything, bring it to me. Oh, if I find anything, bring it to him. There isn't any good news. Man, I didn't know you were playing your basement on PS1. That's so cool. Yeah? It really is? Alright, guys. I don't know where they put the shopkeeper. Uh, I mean, I did. I actually found the location where they put him, but... He's no longer there, so... If you want to buy herbs, you gotta buy herbs somewhere else. Thanks. Appreciate that. Alright. Hmm... It's gonna be a brisk walk. Wait, the door is here. I think. Oh, uh, where they put the door this time? Is it this? This door, right? Yeah. Open up. They really had to go and put a shopkeeper all the way somewhere else. Like, they really had to do that. Now every time I want to shop, I have to go all the way back. Oh, I, I do have two rumbus keys, though. So I don't need to pull one out. I probably should, though. Just in case so I won't forget. Because I do need more rumbus keys if I would like to explore. Equipment. Use item. There you go. I wish the rumbus keys would use themselves automatically. Just because of how many times you have to use them. There is also a spare rumbus key in this door, but there's no way to get inside without using a rhombus key to get in there, so. It would be nice if I would go in there, use a rhombus key, uh, 
take the rumbus key and then teleport out. Then I'd have an extra. Right, L hand should be this way. This way. El hunt. El hunt is not here. There he is. He's still hungry, man. Can you believe that I was really skinny before? Damn. That's crazy. Anyway. I'll buy 23 of those. Actually, since you're selling them in so cheap, I'll buy 33 of those. What can I sell you, sir? Two daggers. Actually, I don't see any situation where I need a dagger. Take all of them. A short sword, yeah. A morning star. You can have that too. Whew, you're not taking the battle hammer. Actually, if I have, I do have a, a big axe, so I don't need the hammer. I'll sell one of the bastard swords, but I don't think I need the, oh, 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 how much you want for the blood crown? Did my eyes deceive me? Where's the blood crown? 9200 That's the most expensive item that I can sell. Damn, I'm not selling it though. But damn. I already found a miner's map, so I don't need to buy one. Don't know what the moon guard is, and we already know there is an amulet of mist inside one of the graves in the east side of that island. I just need to find a way to teleport out of there. And if I do figure it out, I'll also have to go back to the termites hole. Though maybe it's not because the spell they teach you is this poison. And I already know that. So maybe I don't need to. Sif's plume seems important. There is a character on this island that wants a, a, a Sif figurine. And a plume sounds like it might be important to forward in that quest. You know what? Because you're such a nice guy, I'll buy 10 more. Just for the heck of it. I mean, it's so cheap. Why not buy? Right? Ah, oh, what the heck? You know what? Let's buy... Is this how mobile games work? <laughs> I mean, it's, it's so cheap, so... What's the point? Right? There you go. Now I have a... Uh, oh, I cannot buy more than 100. I can buy 99 max. I wanted 101, but... Oh, well. Damn, I did not know that there is a limit. Thank you. See, this guy, because he was true and cheap, I actually bought all the herbs from him. I didn't buy it from some cheap-ass elf. They're telling me 20 per one. This guy's selling them 16 per one. And also, if we know teleportation, I'll drop underneath the second bridge. This one has nothing underneath it, but the second one has a chest. It's just that there is no way out if when you fall down. Get one-shotted. All right, now that we have everything we need, I think we head back now to the big mine. But this time, instead of going to the king's treasury, we're gonna go elsewhere. So this way. And which save am I? I'm gonna create backup saves now. So save, save, save. There you go. So I have two more backup saves in case I somehow screw up and need to delete save file. If I had like one or two more rumbus keys, man. The number one healing weed salesman. Where'd he get them from? Also, I know this place is full of snails. Oh, at least it used to be before I slayed them all. Just making sure I didn't miss anything important. 
because I do like to check around to see if there is anything important. Well, well, well. I wish you were able to open... Bastard, can't you see I'm in the middle of talking? I wish I was able to open the door, take the key, and then go in, but you can't. Such a waste of a rumbus key. Give me that. Now we have to find a rumbus key. There it is. Quite a bit of scrolling, but we do get there eventually. Then we pick up this one. We need every single one we can get. Hmm, I am curious. I do want to check out the prison of the underworld. Where was that? It was next to the king's treasury. Yeah. When we got attacked by all the fireballs, there was a bunch of spiked morning stars swinging from the ceiling. So that's where that was. Was it over there, though? To the big mine? Yeah. Yeah, 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 it was. All right. I think at least it was. Right, there should be like a ba base nearby. Yeah, there should be a base right here. I killed the archers up there. Which is super nice. This is base number four, right? Where was the underworld prison? I'm trying to remember. Was it here? Oh, it must have been here. Oh well. Give me that key. There is another key on the other side of the door, but can't really take it. All right, we're going we're going to the deep mine. We're going back. I don't remember even how we go deep enough. Hmm. Nowadays you'd get 10 pieces, gold pieces for the piece of the blood crown. Nah, this ain't the fake. This is the real deal. Real deal. Whoever tells you 10 gold pieces for a, a crown? Lion. Yo, what the heck is this place? I don't remember this. Actually, I do remember a little bit of it. But I don't remember... Oh, base number 5. I have a key of some... Ooh, this guy took it. He took it like a champ. Okay, no longer a champ, he's dead. There is a locked chest in base 5. Let's check it out. There it is. I don't suppose a simple silver key would open it. It did! 100 gold? Listen, base number one or two had a bow and arrow, which was a game changer. So I thought the other bases are gonna have game changer items. Guess not. I will give this place a glance though before we, we move on ahead. Ooh. I wanna get to the dinosaurs again. Now with the Blood Crown, I might be able to withstand my ground against them. Too bad that my only magic resistance items are cursed. They're just cursed. I'm gonna use the silver key again. It worked last time. It did. I always step back j just in case it's a trap. Another 100 gold. Well, that makes up for all the herbs I bought. <gasps> a rumbus key! Let's go! Though you can never have enough rumbus keys. I want more. I'm greedy. 
There were some archers here that I sniped. I have my doubts. Blood crowns, expensive. All right, so this takes me, I don't remember. I'm trying to get deep into the deep mine, if you know. Uh, oh yeah, that's the thing where I jumped off to learn a spell. I remember that. All right, let's take it. Where does he go? 